What is going on? Charles Botenston here, and today we're going to be talking about something that is extremely important, okay? So when we talk about changing anything, we're talking about habits, we're talking about doing something different, there's only two ways that things happen, okay? Number one is you, something happens in your life that you need to change. The doctor says, you have type 2 diabetes, or you just failed out of school, or you are an alcoholic. Something happens where you need to change, and you will change. The second is, when you actually change by yourself because you're sick and tired. You're just sick and tired. You're sick and tired of being overweight. You're sick and tired of just feeling like shit, no energy. You're sick and tired of being in a relationship that's not working out, sick and tired at your job, whatever the case is. But there is something right before there, and it's called, right before change is awareness, okay? This is, this is the change that you need. And, and an awareness is essentially removing yourself from the matrix, okay? Removing yourself from what, so when you're dialed into the matrix, I'll just go into this really quick. When you're dialed into the matrix, it's all about social media and on your phone and email and just quick hits of dopamine, just quick hits, you know, eating like shit, high fructose corn syrup, cookies, whatever, just quick hits, quick hits, okay? Awareness is, this is what I'm doing wrong. This is why I'm overweight. This is why I'm not in a good relationship. This is why I hate my job. Awareness is actually seeing it unfiltered as in you have a helicopter or you have a camera looking down at the situation. You say, okay, you know what? I need to get out of this. I need to change, okay? From there, then you can change. Awareness, in my mind, comes from one thing and that's education, okay? Education, I'm not talking about school education. I mean, whatever area you have, you want to change, educating yourself on how to start a business, how to do sales, how to do marketing, how to actually, besides start a business, actually do the accounting and growing and managing and scaling out and whatever. If it's health, it's why do I exercise? Why do I need to exercise? What to eat, what to sleep, what to drink, okay? If it's when it comes to a relationship, okay, if I'm in a relationship, it's definitely how to approach or how to approach the relationship in the, in their needs and in mine where it's not 50-50, it's 100-100, okay? So it's awareness comes from education before you could change. Because most people are just going around, as I call it, the der state, the der, okay. Oh, this is what I should buy, Apple, or thank you, Google, for telling me this, or thank you, social media, or my parents, or society, or education, or whatever the case. Social media is way too much of an influence, way too much of a grip. To unplug yourself, you have to educate, okay? There's a, there's a book now, uh, it's actually a documentary, and I was, I was watching the reviews where if you want to suppress a culture, if you want to keep them down, if you want to just pretty much brainwash them, you can't subject them to the outside world. The outside world is YouTube videos, is books, is a library. Any kind of education, you can't subject them to. So. Figure out an area that you want to change, okay? You have to objectively look at yourself, not through the eyes of excuses, not through the eyes of saying, well, the reason I'm not waking up early is because I have a kid, or the reason I'm waking up early is because I'm trying to start a business. The reason I'm not going to the gym is because, you know, I'm, I put that time towards something else, okay? You have to objectively look at it and say, okay, I actually want to get in shape this year. What am I objectively doing wrong that I need to change, okay? Educate yourself, this is why fitness is good, How, which is leads into your why, and then the second is awareness. Once you cultivate awareness and you top down look at your situation, you'll be able to change. But awareness is the key. Awareness of what you're doing right, what you're doing wrong, and this is not from a judgment perspective. This is not to beat you up, it's just, okay, that's why I was hungover or tired or lethargic. That's why the pitch did not go so well. The pitch didn't go so well because I didn't prepare as well as I could. So in the future, I'm going to prepare better. It's not the pitch didn't go well because the weather or because they're in a bad state or because I was going against the top brokers in New York City, whatever the case is. Awareness is everything. Objectively taking the situation for how it is, not how you want it to be, or how you think it should be, but how it actually is. Awareness. Have an awesome day. Subscribe to the videos.